Six months ago, a reindeer farm in Alaska welcomed twins into the world, something that's pretty common for humans but extremely rare for reindeer. Photojournalist Lexi Yelverton takes us to meet the pair and tells us what ways they have been persevering. So we're going to go down this way and around to get in the pen. I'm here at the Williams Reindeer Farm. This is my family's farm, and we've had reindeer here for over 30 years, and it's still run by my family today. The twins are super special, so they kind of became a part of our tour this summer. <laughs> and these are the twins, Spicy and Spike, twin reindeer. They're super awesome. Because Spike was bottle raised, he was in a special pen, and so then when the tour guides would pass him, they would talk about his story. Hi, babies. <laughs> There's Spike. <laughs> Spicy and Spike's mom, her name is Sugar Mama, and she was in labor. One of the staff had reported to me that there's a cow in labor, and she'd been in labor for like 20 minutes. And I was like, it's okay, labor, you know, it usually takes longer than that. But let's go out and check on her. So I went out and we watched the birth. She was a really tame cow, so she let us be right close to her while she was in labor. And we watched the baby pop out, and as soon as the first one came out, I saw that there were two more feet hanging out of her bottom. And I panicked because I was like, oh no, this means twins. And for us, historically, twins have not always survived. Usually one of the twins won't survive or the mom doesn't survive, just the way that twins are. The reindeer are not built for twins. As far as we know, we know a lot of other reindeer farmers and I don't know anybody else who's had twins that survived. So it's really not common. And in 30 years of owning reindeer, we have had twins and not one of them has survived, you know, beyond 24 hours. So um, this was really exciting for us because it is so rare. We did separate Spike and Spicy when they were about a day old, 12 hours old, you know. And um, we've reunited them since then. They're weaned, weaned from the bottle, weaned from their mom. They're in the same pen now. And they find each other often. Like, they eat the same hay bale and they lay together. And I think it's that twin telepathy, you know. They, like, seek each other out even after being separated for months.